Coach, the Wednesday game against Oklahoma City had a seven-point lead in the third quarter, had a tough time getting some rebounds in, in part of that stretch. They hit a couple big threes along the way, but what's your overall view of that contest? Uh, they're a good team, you know, and if you don't sustain 48 minutes of playing like we talked about all year, then, you know, as soon as you have that drop off, they take advantage of those moments. Um, they were able to beat us up on the glass a little bit. We had our bigs getting foul trouble. Uh, we were missing Martin. So, you know, just those factors kind of all played into the game a little bit and towards the end of the game, it just wore down on us a little bit and, and they got the win. You do mention Martin and he is back. How is he going to be fitting into the into the pieces of the puzzle tonight? We'll definitely throw him out there a little bit just to see what he could give us. You know, I think his conditioning might not be the top line, how we need it right now. But, you know, I think he's willing to give us any amount of minutes, whether it's one minute or 10 minutes or whatever it is. So we look forward to having him and throwing him back out there. When you look at the two teams tonight, it doesn't look like there's a whole lot of daylight between these two teams. Um, what are your overall impressions? Uh, we've seen them a lot. Uh, we Obviously, we know their players. We know what they kind of like to run and stuff like that. So... You know, we just want to kind of take our style of basketball and kind of imprint it on the game and, you know, uh, play to the personnel, which we know their tendencies and not have breakdowns on defense and kind of get out on offense and get spacing and get the ball movement. But I think it's all about how we're going to approach the game. And I think, um, you know, we're ready for this game. We look forward to come back home for this homestand and look forward to get it going tonight. Well, since it's the first time for the people here in Sioux Falls to see Stockton this season, once you look at Emmanuel Terry, a, a guy that has been in the Sky Force uniform previously, he's not everything, but he is definitely a, a big piece of what they do. Yeah, he's one of the better bigs in the league, if you ask me. You know, his energy that he brings, the way he gets off of the screen once he sets it. Uh, you know, there's a lot of guys in the NBA making a lot of money doing what he does, and I think he's one of the better bigs in the league, so we'll have our hands full with that. How about um, the players that can get downhill? They, there's some guys who can really um, penetrate and drive and kick on the on this team. Yeah, Coleman's really good. He uh, kind of got the best of us last time we played them, got in the paint a lot. So, you know, we're going to be looking to keep him out the paint. They also got Stewart who gets downhill. So, you know, they have guys that could hit on all cylinders inside and outside, so it just makes uh, a tough night for us. And then what about being able to attack them? How are you going to do that? Uh, just by ball movement, getting the ball moving side to side and, you know, just playing with a purpose on the offensive end. Thanks, Coach. Good luck. Appreciate it. Thank you.